beautiful people welcome again to my channel how are you guys doing i hope you guys are doing fine we are going to the west today to go buy some african groceries so my neighbor my beautiful nigerian neighbor um introduced this place to us we are not going to glory me today we are going to be going to this place in etobicoke i think so that's why we are going to be buying all our african groceries today we want to compare it to lorry because everyone keeps saying lorry made is expensive and even me too i, I think it's expensive but the only reason why i go to lorry meat is because it is a very very good meat that he sells like his meat are like exactly like nigeria owned like when you go to the market in nigeria and you buy meat that's how it is it is so so good and so so strong not the you know not the foul meat or the baby meat like it sells the good ones that's why i keep going back but when you think about the price it's just a lot of money but anyway you guys we're going to be going to this place called cc meat or something like that i'll let you guys know and i'll let you guys know what i think and i'll be sharing everything from a to z with you guys so yeah um yeah this is my cooking channel if you're new here please don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up and share with friends and family and let's go down there all right you guys so we came to this place called cc meat right here my neighbor gave me this place address so we came here unfortunately when we go here they are not killing goat today we have to come tomorrow which we are not looking forward to i'm going to kill the cash yeah right oh makes sense so next time they give us their card next time we'll come back here since we didn't call because we thought it's gonna be like glory but the place is very nice very neat why are you need to go show my address glory Ah, oh my goodness. What is the second? Are you by yourself? Pata pata, please. 29 minutes? 29 minutes. Oh, no, no, no. I'm in Jane Street. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I'm here at Laurie Meat now. So, oh, my God. Okay. all right you guys welcome back again to my channel sorry i'm trying to put this uh tripod down okay welcome back again i started this vlog in my on my phone when i was going to the uh place okay so we went to two places today to um to try out the groceries the first place we went to i filmed it it's called cc meat or something like that uh we, we would have loved that place to shop today but i think you have to cut ahead before you can go buy anything from there so we didn't know it's our first time so we just walked in and they said no they cannot um they cannot sell us any like um full goods so they ha we have to buy the one that is already pre-cut down and everything so i didn't like that i like to see what i'm buying i like to see how big it is you know so we didn't end up buying anything from that place but to be honest it's very nice and clean and neat and very very big it's not like congested like um lorry meat but i've been going to lorry meat for years and i like it so we didn't buy anything from there so we went to lorry meat today i know some of my beautiful mommies on here from toronto um i've been telling me to like book appointment um at the farm to go to the farm but we have 
booked the appointment and it's like equivalent to the same thing which I didn't even film last last time we went to it's like equivalent to the same thing I don't see any difference honestly and so there's no need and over there too you can only buy meat there's nothing like um, shaki and all of that so um, we just decided like to do everything at Lori Meat. I'm very comfortable um, at Lori Meat uh, with the prices and everything. So I compare prices, but um, the, the price difference is not much. So this month, I'd like to uh, bring the receipt for you guys so you guys can see. And I told them to print it properly. I don't know. That place is a very standard place very standard groceries but the way they print their receipts you know how they do it like old ways like they'll be doing like typewriter so i complained last time when i went there and i said come on this is a very nice place like you make a lot of money here like a lot of customers do like a printout receipt come on so i guess they listen to me and this is their receipt very very standard and very very unique so everything we paid this time is 1227 the prices keep going up and down i'm really frustrated about groceries honestly it's a lot of money but the um, when we go to lorry meat everything lasts us for for two months two solid months that's about eight weeks which is amazing like two solid months so i'm gonna show you guys what we picked out this month this is beginning of july i'm gonna show you it's kind of different a little bit i'm gonna start with um what is it called i'm gonna start with the basic one with the dry food here um um i don't even know where to start but i'll show you guys like this um i picked four of these because i just want to have it in the house and forget about it so this will last us like a whole year to be honest I picked out four of the No Kondo Consabo de Polo. I guess I'm bringing something else. Well, chicken flavor. And I got the Overteen because my daughter, this girl right here, loves to make chocolate tea a lot. Chocolate. So I picked out some nice fresh bread. Some Derica tin tomato. I just picked out this. I was like, oh, I love opening, not real champagne, but this on a dinner table um now that we works from home we are gonna be having lots of dinner time family time together so this is perfect and some canned tomatoes time i'm running out on time so i just took out one bag usually my personal shopper will do it but i need some this weekend because i'm gonna be making jello fries i put out some pepper soup oh no i don't want pepper soup i think i put out the wrong thing oh i think it's the same thing pepper soup seasoning barbecue suya yes that's the one i'm looking for so i guess they can use it for barbecue too and pepper soup i picked out two fresh tomato i just saw these for eggs tomorrow um scotch peppers fresh bread and pounded yam i don't even know how much this cost but put that down mommy can you show me oh my god what the cake why 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 you guys doing that oh my god you can chop malik show me the one back. Oh, my back in jail. Oh, you show me go. Three more. Where is the towel? Sorry, guys. We talked scotch pepper. Um, this yam. A case of malt. And this is where all our money goes. So, I'm going to show you guys. Mali, let me pick this up. So, this hard chicken. This is three for three for twelve dollars so put down nine and the bottom part is turkey fresh turkey i bought a whole box of fresh turkey i bought this is oh yeah Lori gave me this for free no not this one i think this one for free yeah this for free he gave this for free uh i bought some kidney this is shaki can I see the shaki i got titus Oh, makra you call it? I don't eat this, but my little likes this, so I got some for him. Um, I got these are goat meat. This is one case of goat meat, like the full goat meat right here with the head and everything here. You can see it. Oh, let's see. And yeah, I think Lori gave us this for free. And we got some. What's this called? Um, 
Is it croca fish? Yes, this is croca fish. You can see how they cut it very, very nice. And the cut is very neat. I like it. So, <laughs> you see? I got a smoked turkey, you guys. Smoked turkey. You can see. You like that? Yeah, Lori gave us this. What's going on? This sliced steaks. My husband likes to make steaks a lot. He loves making steaks. So, I got a whole bunch of steaks. And, yeah. I'm so fascinated about this turkey. This is one box and it cost me $130. So, yeah, that's pretty much everything we got. Everything we got right here. I'm super, super excited. Um, yeah, this is 12, $1,227. Everything we put out here. You see, and the meat. I'm going to go to the 